is case 2025 examination and we all have studied revised and practiced enough right but wait tomorrow we all have revised studied and practiced enough for this case 2025 examination right and tomorrow is the big day the game day and before entering to the exam center please watch this complete video because i am going to give you a checklist of all the important things that you should do before the examination and during the examination so that you can attempt your paper smartly and do not do any mistake while attempting the paper so let's get started and this is going to be a very very important video please watch it completely so first talking about the things to do before entering the examination hall here first carry all your exam essentials this is very very important from tonight or early in the morning please pack your bag properly what all things you should be taking admit card sorry yes you will be taking your admit card or hall ticket any valid identity proof blue or black ball point pen do not carry any equipment or electrical gadgets even do not wear clocks okay uh, like sorry not clocks watches so watches are also not allowed so please don't take that you will get a proper clock in every examination hall and do not wear any kind of wrist watch yes that i have told wrist watch and do not wear shoes okay and one more thing that you can take is a transparent water bottle so that you stay hydrated during the exam okay clear don't take any pouch or anything uh, like what i'll say uh, uh, wallet and all electrical gadgets avoid everything only four things you have to take what is it your admit card your a uh, government identity proof blue or black point pen and then your uh, transparent water bottle okay nothing else these four things you have to carry next dress comfortably okay so do not wear any heavy dress which is uncomfortable you know you are going to write the examination so your mind should be focused only on your paper not on any uncomfortable dress so please wear simple t-shirts and track pants that will be fine and do not wear any jewelries or anything that will not be allowed in the examination hall okay next important thing is to have a proper balanced meal so in the morning get up pack your things dress comfortably have proper balanced meal don't have heavy breakfast just have light and nutritious uh, breakfast and take proper amount of water okay next is arrive early this is very very important you all have got your admit card right so please check your admit card and uh, see your center and reach the examination hall at least 1 to 1.5 hours before the exam starts okay this is very very important if you reach early 2 hours that is also fine but at least 1 and 1/2 hour before you must be there at the center clear next we have avoid last minute cramming so in the morning just don't get up and start studying something new or start uh, remembering anything that you haven't learned so just don't do these things just believe in your preparation whatever you have studied and don't rush at the last moment it will create more confusion rather than helping you to get good marks okay next use restroom so before you enter the examination hall please go and use the restroom because for the next 1 hour or 1 point like 1 hour 20 minutes you will not be allowed to go outside of the examination hall under certain circumstances you may get if you request and all but let's avoid it so it's better to finish your restroom things before going to the examination hall okay now uh stay calm and confident so before the examination starts in the morning do not panic do not talk with your friends how much you have studied what syllabus you completed and just trust yourself believe in your preparation see the mirror and tell that you can do it you have prepared really well for the examination and you will get good marks in this examination okay just give positive affirmations to yourself and do not think anything negative in the morning clear next we'll go to when you are tips to follow while attempting the paper okay when you have already uh, entered the examination hall question paper is in front of you how to attempt the paper clear so first of all read the instructions carefully especially while filling the omr sheet be very sure that where to fill what the name should be written in capital letter i have made a detailed video on how to fill the omr sheet so please uh, see that video and then go so that you don't have any confusion regarding the filling of omr sheet okay next 
encircle the bubbles correctly it should not go out it should be within the circle and do not hesitate to the talk to the invigilator in case of any doubt okay if you have any doubt that how to fill what to fill if you are having any confusion please talk to the invigilator and do not do it by your own if you do any mistake on the omr sheet it cannot be rectified so that is why please avoid that okay talk to your invigilator next skim through the question paper once you get the question paper just try to read the questions in 5 10 minutes or grow through the entire question paper and uh, find out which are the questions that you can start doing very easily which are easy questions for you just start attempting them so that you can boost your confidence okay and you should also see that ensure all the questions are allocated uh, attempted in the allocated time so you will be getting 70 minutes okay so your exam will be from 10:40 am to 11:50 am okay so make sure that you are attempting all the questions there is no negative marking so try to attempt all the questions do not leave any question and whenever you are making any guess make a strategic and smart guess okay next is manage your time wisely so allocate that once you have seen the question paper you will have an idea about the difficulty level of the question so allocate time accordingly so be always have a look at the clock that how much time is left 30 minutes have been completed so at least 20 25 questions should be done so if you are uh, lagging behind increase your pace so after every 5 to 10 minutes have a check on the time okay next is start with easy questions this is very important to boost your confidence whichever is a easy question start with them first next skip strategically so if you are finding any question is taking more time 2 to 3 minutes you are wasting on one question just leave that and go for the next question so you should be attempting the paper in three rounds okay in round number 1 attempt all the questions that you know okay and it is taking less time and you just know do it and move to the next question in round 2 review the questions that you actually know but it takes lot of time or you have left for some reason you want to do it later review those questions and start solving them in last round 3 you just make guessing okay the questions which are completely uh, you are unaware of the concept some out of the box questions has come and you want to guess that answer so that should be done in the round 3 after completing both these sections okay next is review the paper so at least keep 10 minutes of buffer time as i told you 70 minutes are there so 60 minutes should be for solving and 10 minutes you should have buffer time so that you can uh, try the questions that you have not attempted in that method in that period please try to use elimination method and out of four options try to eliminate two options okay next is attempt maximum questions as i told you there is no negative marking so try to attempt 60 questions at all complete question paper try to attempt and for those questions where you are guessing make a smart guess instead of a blind guess okay yes next fill the omr sheet periodically this is very important do not keep the omr sheet to fill at the end or do not fill it after doing every question just solve 10 to 15 questions and then fill the omr sheet solve 10 to 15 questions and then fill the omr sheet okay next we have stay calm this is very important during the exam if you find the question paper is difficult some particular questions are very tough do not worry because that will be tough for all the students who are writing the examination right so just don't panic if you find a difficult question leave that and go for the next question 40% of the like 40 35 to 40 questions will be easy 10 to 15 questions will be moderate 5 to 6 questions will be on the difficult side so that 40 easy questions should be your target okay next yes so this is all about what you should be doing before going to the examination hall and in the examination hall so that you can uh, like peacefully attempt the paper and come back satisfactorily okay so that's all students in this video and all the very best and we will be discussing tomorrow the chemistry paper after the examination all the very best